There is a magical operation of maximum importance. The initiation of a new aeon. When it becomes necessary to utter a word, the whole planet must be bathed in blood. Fulfilling the circle Malak of the Sarfan, you are hereby damned. The pleasures of the flesh are no longer You have but one purpose, damned warrior. You will serve us for eternity. The tavern's closing. Best be on your way, stray stranger. What? No mug of ale for a weary traveller from distant Corhagen? I can reward you well, for I am of noble blood. I stay open for no man in these dark times. Things come with the night that no sane man would welcome. And so I left. Cold of heart and soul. Forced to the road and the long, bitter night. That's him! <laughs> End it! Now! Fay Victus, suffering to the conquered. Ironic that now I was the one suffering. Not anything as pedestrian as physical pain, rather the cruel jab of impotent anger. The hunger for revenge. I didn't care if I was in heaven or hell. All I wanted was to kill my assassins. Sometimes you get to kill. The necromancer Mortanius offered me a chance for vengeance, and like a fool, I jumped at his offer without considering the cost. Nothing is free, not even revenge. <laughs> you will have the blood you hunger for.
I awoke to the pain of a new existence, in a dank womb of darkness and decay. The sanctuary spell enables me to travel to my crypt, where the soil of my grave provides me respite. I often resort to this when I am weak and need nourishment. Reputed to have been ripped from the chest of the greatest vampire to have ever existed, Janos Audron, the heart of darkness restores vampiric unlife. Life is precious, Janos discovered, as it was torn, throbbing and bleeding from his own body. <laughs> this ancient vial bears with it a dark gift indeed, for with it my life force is increased. These ancient symbols of power contain raw, magical energy that increases my own capacity to summon energy for the, spa the spawning of spells. Within the walls of these chambers I could find respite, and, if I so chose, resume my journey when my weariness abated. The world had changed to my eyes. I had not expected such cruelty from the light, for in the embrace of the sun I could find no comfort, only malice. This would change in time for the worse, along with other things. When rainfall comes, vampires are wise to find shelter from its acidic touch. devices hurl bolts of whirling energy and eviscerate my human enemies by stripping ragged flesh from blood-stained bone.
Hunger and weakness are no bar to vengeance's call. I would find my slayers and send them back whence I came. <coughs> what trickery is this? <coughs> there he is! Kill him! Kill him. <coughs> Their sneering faces were forever etched upon my memory. I had crossed death for this moment. My mind was empty save for one thought. I would kill. There is no greater release than that from vengeance sated. With my assassins dead, my quest was over. Over. <laughs> Is not over, Cain. These fools were merely the instruments of your murder, not the cause. Look to their masters, look to the pillars, and gain way to the fortress of the mind. This was where the bloody deed of my murder took place. The necromancer had offered me no warning as to what my resurrection would entail. And yet I must confess in my haste I had not sought one. Was his gift a curse? I would, I would seek the pillars for an answer.
Pillars of Nosgoth. Even in life, few sights have moved me such as this. I marvel that such beauty should grace our dying world. Napraptor, your madness has shattered our dreams and blinded you. Keep your distance, distance, or I'll send you back to hell, spirit! There is nothing left of me to fear, vampire. I'm only a shadow of my former self, Ari, the balance of the Circle of Nine. Even so, I can provide the answers you seek. I seek only a cure. There is no cure for death. Only release. You must destroy the sorcery. The sorcery that is now poisoning Nosgoth. Only then will you realize peace. The Nine of the Protectors of Hope were sworn to use their powers to preserve our world. Now these pillars have been corrupted by a traitor. My murder at the hands of this beast drove my love Napraptor mad. Now he spreads misery and pain among the circles crumbling the very foundation of Nosgoth. You must restore balance. You must right the pillars, pillars of Nosgoth. I care not for the fate of this world. Then for yourself, Cain. Beware the unspoken. Not Raptor, with his blind act of vengeance, threatened to destroy all of Nosgoth. Each Circle member was bonded to the pillar he served. The pillars reflected the mental state of their servants, and as the minds of the Circle degenerated and descended farther into dementia, the pillars crumbled. To restore them, each member of the Circle had to die, and the artifact that served as their link to the pillar had to be returned. Only when all the pillars were restored did Ariel claim my curse would end. And so, my, my hunt for Nupraptor began. The Pillar of the Mind The Pillar of Dimension The Pillar of Conflict. The Pillar of Nature. The Pillar of Energy. The Pillar of Time. The Pillar of States. The Pillar of Death. The Pillar of Balance. As daylight chases darkness, the vampire's power wanes. These beacons serve as landmarks during my flights in bat form. Once I have committed their locations to memory, I can always return. In bat form, I can travel great distances with ease. From my vantage in the heavens, no region of Nosgoth is forbidden to me.
While it is true that natural light weakens a vampire, magical light can have many uses indeed. Help me, please! Help me,
form enables me to move like lightning and leap over obstacles barring my path, but the guise of the wolf brings with it its own kind of hunger and rage. One must be wary in dealing with the spirit forges. The wraith and shades that inhabit them offer items beyond mortal dreams in exchange for a sampling of your blood.
The wraith smiths forge their items with forfeit souls. Shed your blood for me, and these artifacts will be yours. So, you come to the spirit boarded board for help, do you, vampire? Trade your secrets for the blood of the dead, I will. Night dawns, and with it, the vampire grows stronger. Energy Bolt employs magical force in its rawest form, a messy spell, but a potent one nonetheless.
Ah! <laughs> 
The blood of ages flows so sweet. Come drink from us. Your strength has increased, for our blood enhances. The village of Nachtholm was typical of Nosgoth peasantry. Yet amidst the farmers and smithies of the quiet country life prowled brigands and cut purses.
Of all the methods I employ, this is perhaps the cruelest, the cruelest, causing my victim's body to shrink on itself, crushing bones and rupturing organs till the pressure inside bursts the sack of fleshy skin, spraying its contents for all to see. The blood of ages flows so sweet. Come, drink from us. The rain will do you no harm, for our blood preserves. <laughs> oh, please help me, kind sir. Help me, kind sir. Oh. <laughs>
The gypsies, purveyors of distrust and superstition. Most of their babble should be taken with a pinch of salt, since the gypsies often tinker with weary travellers' minds. However, a few gypsies have something interesting to say. <laughs>
the benefits to traveling beneath a human guise. The threat to my person is lessened and much information can be gleaned. However, the illusion is flimsy and any act of aggression on my part can break the spell. Vasabunt lay, its glory now stained and faded, a faithful child in the looming shadow of Nupraptor's retreat. Magic extends into very exotic disciplines, such as the manipulation of time. I am able to slow time down so I can move about quick as a wolf, while all others move as though they were mired in mud. Nupraptor's keep lay west of Vasabunt. I would seek to cut the cancer from its heart. This object strike an enemy, rot and decay would instantly eat their flesh and leave only a pool of blood and tissue. For a time after, the toxins are still active and therefore lethal to the touch.
The wind carried screams from the west. I couldn't help but smile. Someone else in this world was suffering more than I. The gaping moor of Nupraptor's retreat reet, rained upon Nosgoth all his pain and misery. The disease begged to be cleansed. Thank <laughs> you. 